So, welcome back to the second episode already from the Legle series. Not really sure how I'm gonna call it just yet, I suppose, just, you know, uh, Legle and then, like, um, Austrian campaign. I don't know, it seems uh, catchy enough. So, um, last time we basically, like, started off, we made a character called Hank the Truthful or the Lustful of the Nor. But because, you know, TH did not really fit anymore, we are a... The intelligent fellow, noble fellow, and yeah. What I would like to do is uh, get some more troops trained and stuff. It seems uh, like the best thing to start off with. And then I would like to um, get as quickly as I can uh, to uh, to join up with to join up with the uh, how do you call with the Austrians already. That seems like a, a pretty pretty good good start, and I believe you can join up by finding uh, their fort. Where is it? Do they even have a fort? Mm. Military depot. There we go. And hopefully we do not get like engaged by something that completely destroys us. In the beginning, because, you know, that could also start. But, um, why do we want to join up? Because it will... Oh, shite. What are you? You are... Oh, you're running away from me. Well, let me engage you in that case. Oh, well, let's... No, let's first engage those bastards. I mean, seven gens, we should be able to take them. So, surrender or die. And they always wish to die. But, um, yeah, we get, like, a pension. So, we can buy more units. And... Shit, you know? Hmm. We haven't really recovered just yet from our first engagement. But, uh, sure. So, single rank formation. And it's like the exact same map a lot as last time. So, uh, let's see if you can uh, get similar results. So, yeah, let's see. They're not really, you know, in range just yet. Uh, but they seem to be carrying some guns, I suppose. Gentlemen, aim. Make ready to fire. Fire! Not really on target just yet, but y you'll get there, you know, at some point. Reload! Ah, uh, yes. Make ready to fire! Aim! Fire! Uh, not really effective at all. Unfortunate. And they're now returning fire. Alright, gentlemen. And throwing rocks, unfortunately. Make ready! Aim! Fire at will! There we go. Excellent. And do not die, you know, because you guys cost some money, unfortunately. Continue firing at will. Come on, you bugger. There you go. One last guy, uh, but I suppose he is running yeah, out of sight, unfortunately. Uh, let's see, did we take any casualties? Two, four, six gentlemen. We started off with eight, didn't we? Two, four... Oh well. Two, four... Yeah, we lost one guy, I guess? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, I'm like the eighth, eighth gentleman. Okay, good job, gentlemen. Um, well done. Let's see if we can actually find some weapons. Pistol cartridge. Mm, because we're still like waiting for that one last dude to run off to his mother or something. Uh, and we'll know we are victorious when the men start shouting, you know? That's usually the way... Uh, Way it is. 
What did you have? You had a, a hunting musket. Okay, let me drop that. Okay, hunting. There we go. See how this musket uh, operates. Ah, oh, well. Uh, are we there yet? Come on. This is why I need cavalry because you know, and you know, you just send in the cavalry to finish them off. That's usually how I I would like to end. An engagement but, but still I mean we held fast because uh, yeah discipline and such uh, no I don't want to retreat oh well what I want is money you know just to start off this game proper get some better units get some more units just be at our limit Perhaps fight in a war, you know, that's that's what, what you want. In it. In it boys, in it what we want. It's a shame they don't have names or something like that, you know, that would be funny. We could give them names, I suppose, you know, Fritz, Friedrich. Uh, Fulkert, Hans, um, Österreicher recruit, um, and uh, let's fall back. Okay, you've retreated. Oh. Right, okay, let's just, you know, kill this mofo, everyone just, you know, charge. Charge! With a battle advantage of seven. And for some reason you guys can run quicker than I can. Even though I, I would imagine those muskets to be a little bit more heavier rather than like a pistol and a knife and a pistol. Okay, you would actually get some money if you can hit them from this far. Okay, it appears that he's mine. And what does he have? Not much. <laughs> Fire on my command. Bitch. Nice. <laughs> okay, we should have perhaps not done that, but hey. There we are, so we now take them and they actually have pretty nice stuff. So to start off with, they actually have like a red banana I can wear because, you know, this is better than nothing. Um, bent musket cartridges. Um, nope, we're good to go. And we can already sell this at the Ministry Depot. That's uh, an edit plus. Okay. Let's move here. Okay, request to enter the castle and let's go to the depot. Um, recruiter, recruit standard bearer, no quartermaster, no armor, arsenal. Go to the headquarters. Okay, and you are a grenadier's veteran. You are not the guy I want. There he is. I suppose you are. Regimental liaison. Talk to you. Is this something I'm here to enlist? So, well, if that's the case, you are, are in the right place. Now, we don't usually accept trash like you, but you've, uh, you need, uh, for, we have need for new ca cannon fodder. You may be a weak need milk sop now, but when we're done with you, you will be able to soak up shop with the best of them. Excellent. So, 
Uh, I don't recall seeing anything about Cannon Fodder. So uh, I ran to clear my loyalty and get my signing bonus. Actually, I think <laughs> my bad knee attempts me, uh, exempts me. <laughs> I better go. Um, sure. There we go. So, um, the Iron Moon doesn't like us. Emp the Emperor of France, Empire of France doesn't like us. I suppose we've made quite a lot of enemies doing this, but hey. Um, so let's talk. Do I know you? I'm Hank, the lustful of the Moor. At your service. Uh, if any tasks for me, uh, there are some minor errands. Nope. I bet I bet my leaf. You there, Lady Elith. Uh, can I do anything? Nope. Oh well, I just you know wanted this. Um, can I armor? Her? Yes, I can. How much does it cost? Like two hundred buying. It's the buying price. Okay, let me just sell all this crap real quick and make sure I don't sell my books and shit. Oh wait, I actually have a hunting musket. Mm, would I prefer a musket over a pistol or it's a rubbish musket though. Um, no, let's, uh, let's, let's keep it like this for now. All right. Oh, uh, let me think. Oh, I don't have any money. Bollocks. Um, well, in that case, I don't really want to sell anything because, you know, at this point, at this stage of the game, money is very tight. Okay, let me return, forget it, and leave. Or perhaps you could get like some volunteers, some cavalry. So, enlist some volunteers. Uh, line cavalry or light? Let's go for this with some light cavalry. We got one guy, apparently. Party! So we have like one Österreicher Leichter Cavalry Recruit. Cavalry Recruit. Okay, and we can actually upgrade you guys to Österreicher Landwehr Infanterist. Okay, let's, let's do that. Uh, we can't upgrade ourselves just yet. Um, let's make our way to Buda und Pest and hopefully do not encounter any trouble. And oh, that's trouble. That's trouble. But he doesn't really seem to care for me. But I would like some more cavalry. Then we can engage them. Recruit some volunteers. Some more light cavalry. Okay. We only got two apparently. Ooh, those are some nice some uniforms. Okay. Let's see. Eleven versus eleven. That should be an easy kill if we can find the bastard. Uh, let's go to Pressburg. And there's some more volunteers and some more light calf. Marketplace, sell shit. Because you do have money, luckily for us. Okay. There we are. And horse breeder, do you have like a shitty horse? You do. A lame French courier, courier's horse. Um, I think I want to wait until we like like steal a horse of some sort. And uh, let's see, what are you? You are just some unit traveling. Okay, let's continue on increasing our army size. That should uh, should, should work. Um, some more light calf. Sure. So we now have eight light cav, and let's try to get some more line infantry units as well. Okay, how much money do I have? I now have zero francs. Right now, I wish to engage something. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Deserters. Um. I suppose desserts are a tough fight, but uh, yeah, better something than nothing. So, uh, there's no need to fight or to pay passage. Nope. Take it to the field, bitch. We outnumber you more than two to one. 
Okay, gentlemen, let's uh, let's let's keep it tight. Keep it tight. I'll take the cavalry with me. Okay, as you guys make ready to present. Okay, those bastards are right over there, and they uh, they mean to fight. So yeah, but I've got like. Yeah, I suppose just sending in the cat itself should result in quite a swift victory. Okay, so you guys are musketeers. Excellent. Make ready to present. Make ready to present. Fire on my command at least. Okay, let's just like move a little bit further in this direction. And you know they can actually fire when they like take aim, it's such nice. Okay, they are almost ready to fire. First shots are incoming. Gentlemen. All men fire. Uh, we didn't really hit anything. Let them come, I say to you. Okay, they actually like trying to take some pot shots, okay. Ready when you are. Single rank formation, that's a misclick. Oh well, fire at will. Yeah, this is gonna be like uh, nothing. Let's see, cavalry, hear me. First charge. Take him down, would you? What are they aiming at or firing at? You know, are they just like shooting at me or something? Seventeen boys, seventeen. <laughs> okay, let me uh, let me take in the musketeers. And well, I suppose friendly fire is. A Something that might happen, but hey. Okay, three down. And they were with 11 men. Okay, come on, gentlemen. Leave, leave some for me as well. Okay, they're not really doing that much damage to my units. Okay, so we can already take on some deserters, which is nice because those are, yeah, pretty, uh, a little bit more tougher units. So, zero casualties. Nice, nice, nice. Ooh. And we already have uh, a more fancy tunic, which makes us uh, look a little bit more fancier. Nice. And a better hat. Also nice, and these things are worth quite a bit as well. For instance, the gun is worth 100 francs. Excellent! Okay, and some soldiers can also upgrade, and we've taken 70 francs from them as well. Okay, let's see if we can like fight one more unit of deserters. Same, same way, of course. Uh, let's, let's move to Prague. And um, perhaps also check um, reports, factions, um, where can I see a uh, weekly budget report? So, yeah, we are not, not really taking any wages for the party, I suppose, because we are fighting for the Austrians, but hey. Uh, reports, just was there, notes, notes. No factions. Kaisertum Oistreich. And the fighting has begun relatively. Okay, so well, we are at the war with the French and the Rheinbund and with the Polish. And the Regno di Napoli. So I suppose those are the Italian states. 
good news, I suppose, because now we can also start raiding some of the... Yeah, we could try to raid, for instance, uh, some of the Italian states. That's nice, because raiding really gets you money. Like, like good money, you know? <laughs> okay, let's go to Prague and go to markets. General merchants, sell you all this shit. Okay. Thank you. So, and it has been already the second episode. I'd like to thank you for watching and.